So what is popularising science? Well, you can really see that as being everything that isn't filmmaking or creative non-fiction science writing, so mainly books. So in popularising science, we have a master stream in science communication endorsed in popularising science, and that means making scientific or museum exhibits, science shows, um, science theatre, online science communication, digital media, anything you like to think of, blogs, website design, um, production of DVDs for uh, various places that are promoting science, school resources, anything where science research and the community get together. So in popularising science we have a master's course as I've said uh, which is a two-year course like the other streams in science communication where you do coursework for the first year including preparation for your thesis and then in the second year you produce a proper thesis which has to involve a bit of research and also something that is of use to the community in terms of science communication which might be um, uh, a production of an exhibition or a production of resources for uh, school kids of various ages or something useful that you have done some research and produced something for the community. Um, we also have as core to that Masters in Popularising Science we have um, the SCOM or SCOM 406 course which is held in the first semester of each year um, and is the core paper for the Masters in Popularising Science. So, um, so SCOM 406, uh, really, uh, which is called Communicating Science, really involves giving you the basic skills you need to go out and interview scientists and produce um, either film or video or website uh, blogs of, uh, that encapsulates the research that these scientists are doing um, or uh, graphical interpretations of uh, a scientist's research for example. Um, SCOM 406 you also learn how to use a video camera, um, you learn how to work in a team as well as produce your own individual work, uh, you learn how to incorporate uh, pieces that are small films into websites uh, you learn how to uh, use basic software and uh, how to take science research and uh, interpret that in ways that children or uh, adults that don't have a scientific background um, can learn from it. SCOM 406 can be taken by anybody from any background as long as you have a bachelor's degree uh, and a reasonable uh, understanding of how science is done. We also talk uh, in SCOM 406 about the interactions of science and society, ethical considerations in the way science is done, and public attitudes to science and how you have to understand these things in some of the, um, when interpreting some, of, some scientific research for the community. It's a fun course. Um, it's a course that involves a lot of independent work by the students. Uh, they seem to be enjoying it this year and we hope that we have a lot more people uh, enrolling in uh, SCOM 406 next year. Um, it'll give you a lot of good basic skills for communicating your science to the public.